Hi everyone, it's Lily Bell from Melbourne, Australia. I hope you are all well. Well, it is 6.25 a.m. Yes, I know. And it's the 12th of September 2019. Uh, I, a few hours ago, I was lucky enough to be able to go on live. It was just random that uh, I saw him on and he had a panel on and I got on there and it was a lot of fun. I got to meet some new people, got to see some older people. Uh, I'm sure there's a few people that didn't really want to see me, but that's okay. Um, still said hello and wished everyone well. And um, so, yeah, that was a bit of fun. And you're probably saying, well, why are you still awake? I actually slept um, right after dinner. And um, so, yeah, I had and was going to um, do the draw today for the ebook, And I was going to put up the video that I did do, um, which I have scrapped, <laughs> um, because I, I realised that... Um, getting up at, at 11 a.m. is not going to be an option for me. Also, I want to give uh, give more of a chance for the video. I'm not sure if it's a really a video that really did that well, and that's fine, you know. I uh, I don't do videos from, to gain subscriptions, you know, and I kind of hate that word because it sounds so impersonal. Uh, of course, I love you guys. Um, and that's why I don't like to call you subscriptions. <laughs> and um, I really hope that I get to know each and every single one of you um, soon. Uh, so, yeah, it's um, I've totally forgotten what I was saying, guys. I'm really struggling with my, um, with my brain, my cognitive issues. My short-term memory, it's getting a lot worse. Um, I'm not going to cut it. I've always said I was going to be real raw with you and show you how I am and basically this is who I am. Um, so, yeah, I've decided to keep it going for another week um, because, as I said, and... Just to give a few more chances, if it happens that it's still only the two people that have commented, then I will still come live on Thursday. I will do another video on the Wednesday to remind you all. And I will come live and even if it's the, just the two people still, what I'm going to do is I will not do a draw. I'm just simply going to give the ebook to the, those two people. It happens to be three people or more then I will do the draw. Either way, I will be coming on Wednesday. Um, it won't be live, but to let you know the time that I'm thinking of and uh, et cetera. So if you want to be on the live to see me, it won't be for very long. Um, I'll let you know. If not, you can watch it back. Um, I need to let you know that my new mobile phone that literally has not worked properly since the day I got it, but it's been about a month now and the only reason it's taken that long to get looked at is because, as you know, my husband got sick and he ended up in emergency, then in surgery three days later and he had his third amputation, so now... He basically has four toes left. Um, he's doing well, though. He's at home, um, back at his unit, and he's still on IV antibiotics. So he's got, you know, the tube in his arm and and stuff. But uh, it's a little bit annoying for him because um, of moving around. Um, but no pain. Again, catch-22. That's, you know, no pain is fantastic because phantom pain is sh a shocker. I saw my grandfather go through it and I'm glad, I'm so glad that my husband doesn't have to go through that. But, of course, that's how he's ended up losing so many toes um, and almost his foot 
at one stage is because he doesn't feel um, due to diabetes and complications. So there's a warning to people that have got diabetes, you must look after yourself. And my husband will tell you he has not been a good diabetic and at the age of, what, 35, 36, he went into complete renal failure and uh, dialysis wasn't working for him. So I was literally planning his funeral. Uh, but these days, if you really, really look after yourself, um, you shouldn't have to go through any of that. So I just want to, I just went on a little ramble then. But yeah, diabetes can be very, very serious if you do not watch yourself. And even sometimes, unfortunately, even when you do, you get a little bit older. Unfortunately, your circulation's not as good, you don't, you're not as active, and things can happen. But um, to be so young and to go through all those health issues, I know for certain that my husband, Michael, if he could roll back the clock, if only we could do that, right, with many things in life, that he would have done things a lot differently. He was blessed and uh, he got a transplant and um, he's had it now for 17 years. But unfortunately, the damage had been done. Yes, he um, was very, very blessed and uh, he's been able to live, uh, which is... Uh, a gift uh, words can't describe what that is that someone died to give him life um, but in saying that um, unfortunately the damage had been done to nearly every part of his body due to the fact that uh, he just did not take diabetes seriously it is a very serious illness I myself um, have now not got diabetes due to diet and just been very strict. Um, I could have gotten on to the point of actually having injections. I was, I did get on to insulin um, and another medication, but I'm all off that now. And um, I'm very proud of myself for doing that. Uh, so, yeah, I got on a tantrum there. Um so yeah, my mobile phone, <laughs> that has never really worked. And anyway, um, I did uh, my sea monkeys. Now you're probably thinking, hang on, you're swapping from the mobile phone to sea monkeys. And then you went on a rant about diabetes. This is how my brain is. This is what you get. But there's a reason I'm doing this, okay? There, there is a reason to this madness. Um, basically... Uh, the sea monkeys. I did promise that I was going to do uh, a little bit of every day of the cycle of life. You see, I saw, you know, I showed how I did it in the first video. And then from then on, I was just going to do little snippets for about 10 days and then pop them all together. And obviously, it very, very long, but just so you could see the growth. My phone, no, they didn't replace it even though it has not worked from the get-go, it's been taken off to be fixed apparently and it's going to be at least 10 days. I need that phone to record anything other than in my bed and especially the sea monkeys. And let me tell you, there's at least 35 of them and they have grown so fast this time. It is crazy. So I feel absolutely terrible, but can't help. I have got another video explaining what happened to the vlog. Yes, the vlog and etc. I just, I did it two, three weeks ago. I just have not been well enough uh, physically and mentally. When I say mentally, it's my cognitive function um, to edit, edit it. So I will get that up and it will explain what happened to the vlog that everyone was waiting for, the video on it. I will try and do that over the weekend and pop it up for you. What else is there? Um, have you guys been watching the Brooke Skylar Richardson case, the cheerleader? I'm sure most of you uh, have been watching it. 
Um, what do you guys think about that? I would like to do some videos on crime, but not like, you know, I, I can't, in all honesty, go into all the research and, and stuff like that because, trust me, I've signed up to do animal psychology and I haven't been able to do it because of my brain cognitive problems and migraines and then I have to do aromatherapy course for my business and I, I feel very very stupid I know I'm not I know I can't help it so when it comes to um editing videos learning more about YouTube and researching things that I really want to research and trust me I've got I love, I love to study. I love researching. I love history. I love, you know, true crime. I love going going back to the 1920s and 1800s and looking at their crimes and, and history and stuff. And there's so much I want to do. But unfortunately, even at my best, it's a struggle. But... Um, it's something that I, I don't mind talking about, um, giving you my opinion um, and just seeing what you guys think. Um, yeah, I, I do want to go live. Um, there's been reasons why I haven't, just for certain reasons. Um, and I don't want to put myself, I need to put my health first. Um, but I'm going to be looking into all of that. And I do want to start panels like what Save Robbie and others have done. I've been wanting to do that from the get-go. Um, one of my moderators, um, Aussie Broad, love you, chick, um, has known for a while that it's something I've wanted to do. Um, but I'm thinking I might have to do that next year. And, yeah, so thank you to everyone that's a new subscriber. I really appreciate it. Um, please know that... I am unwell and that means that I have very little uh, energy, especially energy. So I do my best. I am mostly bed bound and so my content is a little different to most YouTubers. Uh, again, I try my best and um, you just have to bear with me. Uh, that's all I can say is, and um, you just need to be patient if you can with me. Uh, I appreciate every single one of you. Again, I hope to slowly get to know you all, especially when I start doing more lives and panels. Um, although, <laughs> because I got a short term memory, I might have to take some notes. <laughs> but I'm sure you can forgive me. So that's about it for now and I'll try and get that other video up when I can to explain about the second vlog that has not been done. Well, it was done, but yeah. Uh, what else? I think that's it. Because I've missed you all and again, thank you to all the new subscribers. I hope you're doing well. Comment below where you live. Um, you don't have to tell me you know, exactly where you live, but tell me what country and maybe state. Um, I'm always interested in that. Okay, guys, love you lots. Remember to love and respect yourself and others. And if you're having a bad day, remember there's always tomorrow. Love you lots. Take care always from Lily Bell from Melbourne, Australia. Mwah. Lots of kisses. Bye.